Hello all, welcome back to Tony Oaks Underground. Last time we went to Tampa, we the Tampa Ann, we became amateurs, and we joined Birdhouse. Now we're in San Diego because that's where our team went, and we're just going to join our own team. As you can see up in the corner, we got a Birdhouse symbol up there, because we're on Birdhouse now. Let's face plant. We still do that because that's fun. Let's go find some goals. This guy looks dressed nicely. Yo, let's get some photos for your first magazine ad. We're gonna have you lay down some hammers on this 20 stair set. Hammers. Alright, let's do this. Let me see something basic for starters. Look, we're already getting a photo set. We just got a heel flip over the stairs. That was easy. I mean, we're amateurs still, right, so let's, let's, let's we're awesome. Set down something a bit more difficult. Now with the double kick, but that's twice as difficult. And you see that didn't work. I just re retrying to do then going all the way back. <laughs> now do something extremely hey, difficult. This it's dead. Huge, double impossible. Yeah. That was really easy. You can always boneless just to get more air. That's not good. I'm unconscious though. Ow, we're dead. Now we actually are killing it. And he has nothing to say to that. I guess we're getting our own magazine ad though. That's how good we are. Oh, what are we gonna do for coverage these days? There's one that nobody will volunteer for. There's a bunch of flower boxes up on that sketchy ledge, and they want a picture of one of us grinding some of them down. I wonder why no one volunteers for that. Guess what? You're up, newbie. <laughs> <Don't> <laughs> down. It's okay if you die. We don't care. If this is like, let's send the new guy up there to mentally die. That sounds like a great idea, right? No. All right, here it is. They want to use you blasting some big grab bears. Above us grab is bears. a nice open gap over the front of this atrium. It's perfect for these photos. It's almost like it was set up that way. Work up speed back and forth and do the grabs that I tell you. Use a bonus to jump higher if you need to. Yeah, I know. I already that guy already told me about it a lot. Trust me. We're getting all these photo shoots done though. That's good. Now let's get a picture of something a little tougher over the gap. A little tougher. Like a stiffy. <laughs> that just looks fun. A stiffy. Wow, kid. You've got serious skills. How about another tough one over it? Go for it. Why aren't you guys trying to get shots? I mean don't don't you learn stuff from that? I don't know. I don't know how it works. Crazy. You're unstoppable. They just want one more. Unstoppable. Shot. Let me see something really big over it and we're done here. Alright. Like what? A one foot tail grab. How did that not count? I landed the gap. Whatever. How does this not count? I didn't make it when I did the boneless. <laughs> that is dumb. There we go. Alright newbie, you want coverage? You gotta get creative. You nail this run, your picture will be in a magazine ad for sure. What was I doing before? Tricks and the team photographer will snap the photos. You just worry about busting them over the spine transfer on the statue. Rock and roll, kid. All right. I guess that was a horrible spine transfer. Oh, Duke, the both kick flips. Did you say hey you when I'm clearly busy doing something, taking photographs for my magazine shot? You're gonna distract me now? Really? What an asshole. Anyway, this is not that hard. Just spine transfer over it and do tricks. Same as everything else, really. That's all amateurs do now, is do tricks. What do you think I'm doing? I'm doing exactly what you told me to do, asshole. And that's it. Oh, we're good. Hey, check out the ad for the Idaho kid. This demands a party. Yeah? Tell you what, you're the freshie. You're in charge of the party treats. What? 
<laughs> so we get a party. We're already apparently they already did our magazine ad. That was quick. But now it's time for a party. Let's knock everybody down. That sounds fantastic. So the party's cool and all, but hey, it's Bender. Girls here. It's a total dude festival. Man, maybe it's a skateboarding party. Cart. Find a few ladies. Do whatever it takes to get them back here. Whatever it takes. Don't be slacking. If you don't hurry up, this party. Oh, this is what he meant by treats. Starts. So we're picking up girls in a gardening van for a skateboarding party. A party, huh? Well, maybe if you show me how handy you are with that skateboard, I'll come to your party. Oh, I can show you. Oh, I'll show you more than a combo. Wow, that was cool. You seem like fun. That's all it takes to impress girls. That's all it takes. That and a nice plant thing with plants in the back. That's what girls like. And doing tricks with your skateboard. That's all it takes. Let's run him over. Well, she'd go anywhere. I'm not that easy. <laughs> what a slut. If you want me to go to your party, you're gonna have to show me more. How about some of those neat free? How about twenty thousand points? So this is just manually. You can do tricks while manually. It's pretty fun. You can literally just do a manual combo. I don't know how I actually landed that, it doesn't make sense. You can do a handstand. Someone can do a handstand while skateboarding, they automatically win. That was great. You never see people do that stuff anymore. I like you. Make room and I'll come to the party. Oh she likes me. Don't worry, it's okay. That's all you gotta do to get girls to like you is do some nice manual tricks and bam. Because you don't see that anymore. That's oh, how am I gonna get over there? I did not think this through. Oh, don't worry, it's okay. We can just drive through things. <laughs> Come to your party, police. See, this girl's making sense. In that thing, you're gonna need to prove that you're cooler than that heap you're driving. Show me some of your moves. Look, 40,000 points. Oh, I ruined it. She thinks I'm not cool. Whoa, what? They're not even like looking at me. I could just skate away. First of all, how do we even know this girl was here? She's in like the back. Nobody goes here. There's nothing here. Why is she even here? Okay, that was close. Do some. Woo. I mean, I just did some tricks. That was it. Even if I do have to write in that thing, let's go. By the way, this is safe. They're just sitting in the back, no seat belts, nothing. We can do this, and they're perfectly fine. Yep, I see nothing wrong with this. <laughs> That's how cars work in real life, too. Oh, this game is fantastic. So let's go back, we got the girls, we spun out of control hitting a post, they're perfectly safe, and we're good. We got the girls, and we're back here somehow, why, I don't know. And we're dead. His knee's broken, again. Hey, what do you got to say? Band guy? Well, we got all this fast. They snaked it? Can you help us find him? Otherwise, can't play for you guys. Let's just try this again. All right. So we gotta find instruments for him because they don't know where they are because they're j jerks, I guess. I don't know. Someone threw something up here, a microphone. I don't know how they got that up there, but it is. Nonetheless, we got it for him. The first skateboards, only skateboards can do that. We just really got hurt right there. I don't actually know where all these are. Whoa, oh god. There's one, oh my god. We're just getting run over all over the place. But we found all of them, so I go get them. 
let's see. Up here, I don't know how people got their instruments way up here in the first place. Who threw a guitar up here and was perfectly fine with it? I don't know. Everyone in this game just seems to be better at doing a lot of things, like drumsticks just randomly in the bush. That's fine, whatever. I think it's almost time for this party. Let's talk to this this girl. Oh, it's Todd. Do I do everything apparently? We might. All right, so he wants us to go and plant on these bright green ones. I think are more attractive than the actual flyers themselves, more noticeable at least. There's one up here. Don't let it fool you. You gotta come all the way up here. You'll get lost. But you're like, oh, we got that one. We don't need to come up here, but you do. Trust me, and then it's impossible, so you're not lined up straight, you don't do it. Why can't we just, like, walk up to them? Because they gotta make sure they stick. Okay, we can just press on it, but I guess that doesn't make sense. We have to wall plant it, specifically. Why do we need flyers for this party? By the Ow! Oh, man, you killed me. I'm dead. Thanks a lot. Like, I'm pretty sure everyone knows there's a party going on. This San Diego is not that big right now. It's really small. It's like three streets and that's all San Diego. So I don't see what the issue is. And the last one's right over here. Just drive right through him. Not get run over by that guy. And we're good. Party time. Hey, I snuck out of the party and hooked up some real fun. I snaked one of those carts from behind the amphitheater. And some of the other guys set up a little racetrack for us. See if you can beat my best lap. It's gonna take some skittles, as that dork Todd likes to put. Are they sour skittles? Anyway, now we just stole a security cart somehow, and we're creating a racetrack, and we're gonna race through it because that is what skateboarders do for fun, I guess. I don't know. It doesn't seem like what should be doing a break in the law that doesn't seem like the smartest thing to do but whatever we're professionals so oh, we're amateurs so that's why we're doing it because we'll get busted for it probably go to jail and they won't care about us I think that's what's happening this whole thing is basically do this ridiculous done do this trick and then basically this is what happens we get arrested I cannot break down that sign. That's kind of funny. Either way, not that hard to beat his score. He's not a very good racer. Then it gets dark. <laughs> we got drunk. Awesome. There you are. Hey. Come on, it's two in the afternoon and you're still asleep? You gotta skate the demo at three. No, what demo? The team demo! Come on, I want you to get the new guy hooked up. Sup, what? Eric? Eric? You're on the team? But how'd you... With no help from you. But that's cool, I can see how busy you've been. Ah, you got I don't like your tone, Eric. <laughs> anyway, why don't you find the rest of the team? They scattered after the party. I'll see you guys at the demo after I chow down. All right, so maybe we didn't help Eric get on, but I mean, he forgot our name with the Tamp Am, so I guess we're even now. So I guess, you know, everything's fair. We'll be... All right, so we're not going to talk to him. He is annoying. Let's talk to Skirt Nerd, actually. Yeah, looks like we got our cart back. And there's some free skateboards on the back. How nice of you punks to leave these here for us after you stole our cart in the first place. Have a nice day. Yeah, he's a nerd, but at least he makes sense. And now we just have to literally sketch onto this car for a whole minute. This is the goal. Oh god. Oh, and there's that too. Oh, this is nice and just stops for us. That's really kind of him. So you gotta keep switching sides to avoid running into them. It's... yeah. Because just hitting them will knock you off your board. And you just have to consecutively keep doing this. Until you get off and they give you your stuff back. Um, if only we're the only person with the skateboard left. That's that's good because if we didn't have ours, we'd be screwed. 
Now, at least he's really nice and doesn't want to run you over. Like, he's an asshole for taking your stuff, but he doesn't want to kill you. You know, that's really, that's really kind of him. And, hey, get back here. This can be annoying, is trying to get back. And then that happening too. You just gotta cut corners. And then that happens again and you're really screwed and then you drive ahead of them. There we go, I think we got it. It could just be really annoying trying to get on and off again and again. And then that happens. This is not difficult, it's more just tedious than anything. But we almost got with it. Thank goodness. I guess they just give up after this and it's like, yeah, you can have your stuff back, we don't care anymore. And we got a gap for that, that's pretty funny. We have amazing speed, wow. Okay. And we're dead. I think we've died a lot in this in this so far. Let's see. I'm not gonna talk to you, shut up. Almost get run over. Demo, who are you? Hey, you're singing with Brad. Let's see what you got, and maybe we'll come to your demo. How about a nice fat I mean, combo? You know, there's gonna be like other pros there too. Why is it just me? Like, why do I matter? And I like did like twice what he wanted, so that that he is a pretty snot nosed kid. Not as bad as spoiled brat, but you know. The guy delivering our stickers just told me that the box came open on the way in and they blew out all over the place. Well, that sucks. You gotta grab them all or we'll have I to have to? to the crowd at the demo. I mean, they can just sit, or, sit around on the thing, too. That seems fine to me, too. People pick them up and be like, oh, look, stickers. And then, like, oh, wow, skate. I mean, that maybe that's a better marketing thing, too. Get everybody involved. Don't bail at a time like that. And we got him. Time for you guys to get out there and earn your keep. Yeah, let's do our first demo. Anyway, if you're as good as they say you are, then do whatever grind I tell you to up on that raised bar. Why is this kid telling us what to do? Shouldn't we be able to do whatever we want? Like, just saying. Like, it should be like our demo, we do what we want, not this kid tells us what to do and we do it. That doesn't really make sense to me. Either way, just do it is not that hard. Well, apparently this is impressing because we're just doing really simple grinds. And he he's fine with it. And where are all the other pros doing demos too? Shouldn't they be here? Hi there. We're from the local paper, the Daily Clueless. We saw it's like a great name. Kids with your magic moves. Can you maybe dazzle us with magic. some of your skills? That would be super terrific. Thanks, Skater. Super dude. terrific. Skater dude. You are horrible. Anyway, we just got to get a high score. Really simple. Well, I did not want to do that, but oh no. Okay. Not that hard to get a high score. I wonder if they knew high scores in real life. <laughs> you have to get a high score to get into a magazine. I think that's how it works. Hey Ripper, my buddies refused to believe me when I told Ripper? them how good you are. They want to see you hold some crazy lip trick up on the stage lights. That sounds dangerous. Anyway, we gotta do a special trick. So, bailing ruined your special, so I just ruined everything. So, this seems like the most dangerous thing in the world, but we did it. Yep. 
And that's San Diego. Can you believe it? Hawaii. You must be stoked. The team usually doesn't bring hams on a trip this big. And those sketches are awesome. Did you draw them? Nah, some artist did. They're the graphics for my new pro model. Hey, how long were you on the team before you turned pro? About a year. I just threw down a couple hammers for the last video, and the response was so crazy, they gave me a pro board. Who knows? Do the same, maybe they'll turn you pro in a few years. And with that, San Diego is over, and we're on our way to Hawaii. We are good enough as amateurs that we get to go to Hawaii, even though he just said we don't. Alright you rats, here's the deal. We paid for your trip to Hawaii, getting sick footage is your job. Bomb around and find some interesting spots. Then we're gonna premiere our video in Vancouver at the Slam City Jam. So don't half-ass it! We hook up in three days. And with that, we are in Hawaii. We have to do some guys skits for our video, but we got a free tip to Hawaii. So being amateur is paying off. Eric's with us here too. I'm sure we'll see him. Uh, that's all for this time though. Until then, see you later.